It's a total takedown. A dozen members of a violent gang are off the streets and behind bars tonight. The takedown took place after a month investigation. Liza Danver is live at the Montgomery County Sheriff's Office with evidence authorities uncovered that ultimately led to the gang's takedown. A joint task force of the Montgomery County Sheriff's Office, Dayton Police, and the FBI all teamed up to take down 12 gang members. A grand jury handed down this indictment, slapping federal charges on the men. They're all facing charges of drug trafficking, possession, and various gun charges. Formerly known as Zone 6, these guys now go by the BPN gang. This surveillance video of a robbery and shooting outside J.P.'s bar on Gettysburg launched the massive investigation in April 2011. And we began to find linkages to other gun crimes. So that basically told us that we needed to do something to protect the public that this group of individuals need to be a priority for investigation. In the video, you can see the man with his hands up getting robbed by a BPN member. Meantime, another member gets an assault rifle out of the car, starting a huge shootout. This is what we're up against. You know, the weapons they carry, you know, they, they don't care about the safety of anybody. Authorities say the 12 gang members are behind bars tonight and linked to multiple armed robberies, shootings and homicides, in addition to being big time dope dealers. Taking this, this network out, I mean, you're talking about probably several kilos of heroin that's coming off the street just from the attribute to these individuals alone. This investigation is also shedding light on high profile stories we've told you about. Turns out the undercover officer who was shot at Leo's two a few months ago was at the bar conducting surveillance on the gang. Last month, a fatal accident on Gettysburg killed this BPN member. Police say he crashed while trying to ditch an undercover who was also doing surveillance for this investigation into a group authorities consider one of the most dangerous gangs on the Dayton streets. And right now, authorities aren't saying which homicides the gang members are allegedly connected to. But once those investigations are complete, more charges against them could be coming. Live in Dayton, Liza Danver, Fox 45 News.